Now, here's your Pentagon Channel report. The Pentagon announced Thursday Ohio and Washington have been selected as the first states to host new National Guard Homeland Response Forces. The response forces were called in the 2010 Quadrennial Defense Review and are designed to work in collaboration with the Federal Emergency Management Agency to provide rapid response to chemical, biological, radiological, nuclear and high explosive attacks. Officials say the Defense Department plans to establish 10 Homeland Response Forces, one in each of the 10 FEMA regions. The commander of U.S. Northern Command and North American Aerospace Defense Command, Admiral James Winnefeld, says the U.S. is not in danger right now, but the knowledge some nations and terrorist groups have an interest in obtaining weapons of mass destruction underscores the importance of these response forces. And stay tuned to the Pentagon Channel throughout the day for all your late-breaking military news and information. Coming up at 12.30 on Around the Services, when trying to decide what gear works best for U.S. Army forces, the Maneuver Battle Lab at Fort Benning, Georgia, draws from the experience of soldiers who have served downrange. We'll explain tech-savvy soldiers are working with the Battle Lab and using the latest, latest technology. Plus, we'll go downrange for the latest news from Iraq and Afghanistan. I'm Staff Sergeant Ali Rose.